She took a house that had been abandoned for 30 years and created something absolutely epic. I came across the story of a woman who inherited her great-great-grandmother's home that had been abandoned for 30 years and decided to take on the renovation in order to create a home. I just had to share her experience because I know how much work and dedication went into it. It made me proud and reminded me of the situation I put myself into over 10 years ago. I wanted to share his abandoned house remodel because it simply deserves to be shared. It's inspiring to say the least and the quality of work is up there with the best. This is no easy feat, especially when you're dealing with a house that's been abandoned for over 30 years. This is the great-great-grandmother's house many, many years ago. She passed on and the house was simply abandoned. It sat there for over 30 years while nature took its course and started to deteriorate the old farmhouse. The house and the property stayed in the family and they decided that something needed to be done. The demolition and cleanup are often the funnest part. You never know what you're going to find and you can get a little crazy and not worry about breaking things. While it's dirty and slightly tedious, it's usually one of my favorite parts of any build. You can see that the house has sat for years. I'm shocked that the interior is in as good a shape as it is. I would have expected a lot of water damage or some structural issues. This place looks like it'll be the perfect canvas for her vision. While the house was probably beautiful in its prime over 30 years ago, it obviously is very dated and in need of a complete overhaul. The exterior of the house was painted a modern and neutral color with some beautiful bright white accents. The door and the roof shingles were replaced, guaranteed that the elements from affecting any of the build that was taking place on the inside. The interior required much more than was expected. The plumbing and electrical systems had to be replaced and brought up to modern safety codes. The house was given to her, so she easily justified the costs involved. One of the bedrooms had a small amount of water damage in the corner that was a slight concern. The new shingles and exterior dress-up took care of this without issue. She chose a light wood floor that really sets off the dark wood cabinets and the dark granite countertops. The white grout set in the dark colored backsplash tiles also pops. I think these small details make a world of difference and really make the kitchen stand out. I love the quaint dining room. Plenty of room for an intimate dinner and just enough space to offer a modern desk and workstation. The kitchen and the dining room lead into spacious living room. All the light fixtures and outlets had to be replaced along with the electrical. These old homes can have some pretty sketchy electrical systems and who knows what had to be done to them over the years without proper inspection. It would be horrible if an electrical fire ruined all this beautiful work. I love the look of the brand new stainless appliances in combination with the organic materials like the light and dark woods along with the dark granite countertops. New window treatments and some gorgeous crown molding really tie things together and give this old farmhouse a comfortable feel. The colors of the accessories and decorations all flow together seamlessly. The living room looks like the perfect place to plop down and relax after a long day's work. The size of this home is perfect for a couple or a small family. The bedroom was completely refinished and every square inch was updated. It's come a long way from the dated wallpaper and crusty flooring that it had. I am in love with this couch. It looks like it was built specifically for the living room. What a find. The bathroom turned out a lot better than I expected it to. I love that the backsplash tiles were used above the sink and they match the kitchen. The shower bath enclosure is modern and very functional. I love that it cuts into the wall offering a little more space to move. She obviously has a huge love for cats. She implemented a bench in the mudroom that has a small opening on one side. The bench top lifts up to expose a litter box that's completely hidden from view. Brilliant idea. This image just makes me want to curl up in my bed and put on a good movie. There's nothing quite like the comfort you feel in your own bedroom, especially one that you built solely for yourself. Just off the living room and kitchen, you can access bedroom and bathroom. The beautiful hardwood floors tie everything together and give the home a comfortable flow throughout. You can't go wrong with a view like that. She found this cat on the property during the renovation and decided to give it a loving home. After a vet visit and a few problems to overcome, this cat's now living in luxury looking out at the fields it once roamed. 